When it's two teams whose last four full seasons each have gone 24 and 26, it's not that exciting. When it's the number one and number three most winningest programs in college football history, in the first night game in Michigan Stadium history, it's as good as it gets. Tommy Reese was on his game, Theo Riddick here, as Notre Dame's up seven to nothing early on. A little later on in the first, Irish driving again, Sear Wood up the middle, four yards, and the Irish looked quite impressive in this first half. It's 14 nothing before he can blink. Second quarter, same score. Reese, remember this is the guy who gets the start, did not get it week one, rolls out. Jordan Kovacs, glad to have you here. First and 10 for the Wolverines, just a couple plays later. Denard Robinson will drop back. Could you get some protection or what? Look at all day long, he has to throw to Junior Hemingway. Jump ball, he got it. Dives for the pylon. Look at it again, a great effort, that does count. Score at halftime, 17 to seven, Michigan is losing. Third quarter, same score, more from Notre Dame. Both teams wearing these throwback jerseys as you see. Reese, TJ Jones for the first down and then the touchdown, it's 24 to seven. But Michigan comes back. Robinson, on the 18 yard line, rolls out. Watch what does, the defender's holding on to him and he still chucks it up. Finds Hemingway, who is G-O-N and gone. 77 yards inside the 10-yard line. First and 10. That would set up a little later on in the fourth quarter. Hopkins. Oh, the ball is loose. And Denard is there to pick it up. And this is official. The comeback is on. It's 24-7. The touchdown makes it 24-14. Next chance they get it. Denard. Floats it up, another jump ball. Jeremy Gallen with leaders of fun. A 14 yard score, Michigan's down three. A minute 22 left. Robinson needs a score. Driving, Vincent Smith. Jukes past a couple of men, goes past another for the end zone and Michigan leads. Get ready for the ball game to end. Oh no, sir, we're nowhere near being done. Notre Dame, less than a minute to go. Theo Riddick, oh this is a pass interference. Notre Dame will still be alive. 36 seconds left. Reese. There's Riddick, wide open. 31 28 Irish lead. Now the ball game's over. They've got it right. Wrong. Because Michigan, with 23 seconds left, has a second and 10. Denard Robinson has to roll. Looks open and finds a wide open Jeremy Gallon. The clock is ticking, but the yards are piling up. This was a 64 yard grab with eight seconds left. They do not go for the field goal to tie. Roy Roundtree on the right side of the end zone. Ball game. Michigan wins it. The only catch on the day for Roy Roundtree. There was pass interference on it as well. Didn't matter. 35 to 31. Michigan wins 28 points in the fourth quarter. That makes it three straight years. Michigan has beaten Notre Dame on a score in the final minute. And what a comeback it was in Michigan history. It was almost as good as it's ever been. 17 points this year, only two games, both happened to happen in the last decade, only two games where they're a bigger comeback in Michigan history. It was tough to put more drama on this day, but somehow they found a way to do it.